This is your evening KRQE.com webcast. Mark Ronchetti starts us off with weather. Dean, we're looking at an interesting forecast here with high pressure overhead. It's going to be tough to get a lot going storm wise. Temperatures will be about five to seven degrees above average over the next couple of days. Most of the storm is going to stay off to our southeast. However, going late into the weekend, high pressure will start to shift a little bit and we will start to add more storms to the mix. All right, Mark, thank you. A judge today upheld a ruling that Los Alamos County must issue marriage licenses to same sex couples. The district court judge told County Clerk Sharon Stover that she is required to issue marriage licenses to any two people. Stover had said she would not issue marriage licenses to same sex couples and went to court to defend that decision. Janet Newton and Maria Thibodeau, who applied for a marriage license last week in Los Alamos County and were denied, were in the courtroom to hear today's ruling. Stover has not said if she will appeal. A federal judge in Albuquerque will soon decide whether a Roswell horse slaughter plant can open. Animal rights groups are suing to keep the Valley Meat Company from opening, saying the feds failed to do the proper environmental studies before issuing the company's permits. The plant's attorney says the case has now been put on the court schedule. Each side will file briefs over the next month stating their position, and the judge will issue a final ruling by the end of October. The animal rights groups have had to post a bond to cover Valley Meat's financial losses should they lose in court. Join us for more news tonight on KRQE News 13 at 10.